Hey, welcome back to the channel. I know it's been a while, but I wanted to share some updates on my current journaling desk. This desk used to be my office space, but ever since I moved to another desk, I had extra real estate and kind of wanted to use it and transform this into the journaling desk that it is right now. There's clearly nothing much going on here. I keep everything hidden, but everything that's exposed are the pens, the paper, and the notebooks. One of the things that I keep on display here is the traveler's notebook. And it's important for me to keep it on the desk so that I'm reminded to write on it every day. And I keep the traveler's notebook binder clips and the page anchor on the side because the book doesn't really lay flat and it helps when I write on my bullet journal. Over here we have my pen holder. This one is from Galen Leather and I'll put a link in the description down below with also the pens that I keep in here. I do have other stationary items like the Shreya ruler and the iris drawing compass from Maker's Cabinet. Up next are the notebooks. So here is an old vintage box that I found laying around and I repurposed it into a sort of a bookshelf. And I have all of the active notebooks that I use. I have bullet journal archives, I have projects that I intend on working on, just like this one right here. This old notebook that I plan on moving over to the traveler's notebook and I have the stream of consciousness journal here uh, this is just an enigma notebook from Toroko design and I have the everyday pad from Galen leather for everyday writing and off to the side we have some pens that I don't really use but these are um, cheap pens usually and some inks that I have laying around just like the Sailor 223. I do keep some poster boards on the side. I just DIY'd some just so I can use it for my backgrounds on Instagram or on the blog. In case you're wondering where this one is from, this is from Galen Leather. It's a desk pad in the Crazy Horse Tan, I believe. And to preserve the leather, I use this leather milk or a leather balm. So I just wipe it off and polish the leather. Another thing that I repurposed was an old bedside table lamp with a 3 watt light bulb. So again, I know this isn't the fanciest desk, but it really serves its purpose with keeping my focus on what I need to do. Thanks for watching. I got a journal for real, so I'll see you next time.